Money is turning mobile and my country, Kenya, is leading the way. Only 4 million Kenyans have bank accounts, but 10 million people here use the M-Pesa money transfer service. This shop is one of 17,000 agents throughout the country. Customers come and do M-Pesa transactions. They either deposit or they withdraw cash. Customers transfer money electronically using their mobile phone and the agent converts it into Kenya shillings. Safaricom launched M-Pesa just three years ago and already half the adult population is using it, many to send money to family living in the countryside. I don't have to travel from here to Moranga to take money to my parents. I can just send it from here. And within seconds, the cash is in their phones and they are going to withdraw it and enjoy themselves. When I'm away and the workers need to purchase maybe a material or something like that, I do have to go where they are. I just send money to them in their phone. Then they will draw it wherever they are and work is done. So I find it very efficient. Patrick showed us how he loads up electronic value on his phone. So I give her my mobile phone number. Now I'm receiving a message from M-Pesa. Confirm Kenya shillings 100 cash. I have to sign that I've received that money in my phone. Now I can send this money where I want or pay a bill, electricity, water, or buy some items with it. M-Pesa users say they value the service because it's convenient, cheap, and safe. Initially I thought these are con men, <laughs> but when it worked, I found it good. Since then, I've been using it. Green and Pesa shops are popping up everywhere, including here in Kibera, a slum of more than a million people in my hometown of Nairobi. There are so many Pesa around here where I can withdraw the cash. It simply makes work easier for me. Anytime you like to use it, everywhere you go, you will find a Pesa. A city within a city, Kibera has a fully operating economy. Poor people buy and sell small goods in busy toy markets. Millions of tiny cash transactions like this take place every day. I use M-Pesa. I use it when I'm buying maize from the garden. Before M-Pesa, small merchants like Mary sent money using informal bus and matatu companies. But these companies aren't licensed to transfer money, so it's risky. The cost and inconvenience of traveling to the city center meant that Mary was effectively excluded from banking services. But today, mobile money is bringing banking to Kibera, and M-Pesa is a gateway to financial inclusion. Innovations in mobile money are changing the face of banking in Kenya. The dream of financial inclusion is seeing the light of day, and my country is leading the way.